want to make a prediction on how long you think this is going to take? Um, it's handy because it's just come. It's just about to tick over to one o'clock. Uh -huh. So I'm going to say we'll have everything away. My optimistic guess is by two. My realistic guess is by five. So between one and four hours, I think this is going to take. What about you? And my, so you said it's one o'clock. It's one o'clock. All right, so I'm saying everything put away by two. Okay. Yes, I want to get it done in an hour. So we have to unpack under the sink. Everything. Everything has to come out because the shelves have to come out, both shelves, then get the gold per out, disconnect the gold part, turn off the electricity and pull the gold per out, clean the gold part, reinstall it, put everything back in the cupboard. That's an hour's work. Even optimistically, that's two hours. Okay, that's everything out. Okay. What time is it? <laughs> It's, have a guess how long that took? 10 minutes. Yeah, nine minutes. There's the culprit. It's only another 10 minutes. Yeah. Oh, it's hot under there. Okay. So what we want to do is take this apart and we really don't want to replace anything. We really just want to clean it out. We noticed a couple of days ago that because we take navy showers and we turn the water off between soaping up and washing down, <laughs> we didn't really notice that the gulp was working slow until we had an indulgent shower the other day and then we started to talk about it and realised that the gulp probably wasn't um, working as efficiently as it could. It's clear. Okay. So the gulper essentially is, you can get um, spares kits to replace like these seals and stuff, but the seal yeah, looks the seal's really in good, good. quality. Um, it's a bit gunky in there, which is to be expected with all the shower and the stuff that goes through. Um, so I guess I'll just give it a quick wash over in vinegar and then put it back together but that's the only bit that the water goes through maybe these filters need to come off yeah maybe I just think to have so, a look because yeah. that that would be stopping well we cleaned it pretty thoroughly so these were kind of yellow um that's all the gunk that came off it inside's pretty squeaky clean And we're going to reassemble it and see whether or not that fixes the problem. We are up to 30 minutes. We have been under the sink. We've put the gulp back and we have tested it. And it took how long? What's the time? It's just coming up to four o'clock. Yeah. What did I say? Four o'clock? Five. You five. said five. In um, in our defence, there was a slight extra problem that we located. Welcome to boat life. The, so the reason that it took a little bit longer is because I found another problem under the sink. There was a pipe that had a very slow drip coming from it. So every, probably about one in the morning, the boat would burp. And if you have the water a... water pump would burp. Yeah, if you have a boat, you know what I mean. It's just suddenly a... Oh, there's a leak somewhere. So fortunately, hopefully we found a slow leak under the sink. So yes, that was I, really good. I fixed that as well. And Then um, when we put the gulper back together, we thought we would check the um, external piping, the pipe that takes it out of the boat. And if you passed by today, that's what you saw me doing. <laughs> God, so many people pass by and say hi. I had a flexible metal kind of pipe cleaner sink cleaner that i was inserting into the outlet and then found that there was a whole clump of hair 
so I'm I actually don't know where that came from. <laughs> I'm actually thinking that our goal pool is fine. You saw it when we pulled it apart. Yeah, so that's why we then went to the to clean the pipes because there was nothing wrong with the gulper except yeah. for a slight buildup of gunk. Yeah. But that wouldn't have caused the pressure to lose. That's all clean now. That's just life, really. So hopefully it's been interesting for you um, and slightly informative if you are thinking about cleaning your gulper. It yep. would literally, like we stopped the clock and we were 20 minutes in and we had the gulper in pieces and then we started the clock again 20 minutes ago and so pretty much from go to woe just to clean the gulper it took 40 minutes. And if you were going to replace the parts in your whale gulper it would be a similar process. There's one extra bit, the suction cup that we didn't take off. Yes. Um, but if you were replacing it you get a replacement parts kit and it's really straightforward. You just undo those two screws and replace the parts yes so if we can do it well if i can do it anyone can so hopefully you liked it give us a like and if you want to subscribe click the subscribe button and click the bell to be notified for more videos thanks, thanks for watching bye, bye.